Faith comes by hearing, and hearing by the word of God, right? So you now understand, though, the Bible says that the word being preached to them did not do them any profit because it was not mixed with faith. So when the word comes, faith comes with it. But they come together, but it's not mixed. You, when it comes, you hear the word, faith is there. You take faith at that point, faith is there. Doesn't matter how much faith you have, faith is there. Whatever faith it takes to fulfill the word preached is present. But you have to decide that you are going to now take that faith and act. Because, now understand, faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. So you got faith, and you got the word of God, then you got faith that rides with it. Wherever the word is, faith is there. Do you get that? Now, but before faith, there's another important aspect. See, many times people don't mix the faith that comes with the word because they don't have the precursor to it or the pre-ingredient. What is the pre-ingredient to faith? Hope. See, that's why testimonies are important. That's why when you go into a city, you heal the sick, and then the testimony spread, people hear it. When they hear the testimonies, they gain hope. Well, it happened for him. It could happen for me. And so you gain hope. Then when you hear the word preached, the faith is there, and you go, well, it happened for them. Now you've already got hope. You say it happened for them. It could happen for me. I'll take that. And then you mix it. Then there is an act. See, faith is an act. It's not a mental belief, right? It's not just going, well, I agree. Why? Because devils believe and tremble, and they ain't saved. Well, we got a lot of Christians that believe and tremble, but they ain't saved. Why? Because they don't act on the word that's preached. Are you, are you getting it? 